Welcome to the third um, play, play Piano Super Fast in an Hour um, video here at Brooklyn Guitar School. We're here in the Brooklyn Piano and Voice Studio, uh, brooklynpianoandvoice.com. Uh, if you want to check it out, uh, we have just learned the names of the notes on the piano. We can play any note. If I say play a G flat, shakazoo, you just play it real quick because you've been practicing and you memorize all the notes. Uh, we also learned how to do a five note scale which comprises of um, a bunch of whole steps and one half step. So whole step, whole step, half step, and then a whole step, and then back down. So we can do that in any from any note, based on the fact that we know that it's a half step from the three to the four, and based on the fact that we know what it's supposed to sound like. If we go one, two, three, that's not right. And we can hear that right away, and we'll just fix it, right? So, this is the really exciting part, because if I was going to sit here and teach you how to play every major and minor chord on a guitar, we would be here for a long time. Fortunately, the piano is uh, laid out uh, in a much more user-friendly way. So I'm going to teach you how to play every major and minor chord in the next two minutes, believe it or not. So, we've got the five note scale, one, two, three, four, five, four, three, two, one. What we do is we take the one, the three, and the five and that makes our major chords, right? So, one, two, three, four, five. So that should be your thumb, your middle finger, and your pinky. And that should sound familiar too. That's a major chord. So, this chord is C major. Okay, so you can apply that to any of your five note scales. Let's take uh, F. Take the one, the three, and the five. There's F major. Okay? Some of them have black keys. If I say D, one, two, three, half step to four, four, five, four, three, two, one. Then I take one, three, and five. There is a D major chord. Okay? So, now minor chords. This is the simple part. All you have to do, you take your major chord, your C major, right? You take your three, one, two, three, and you lower that, your middle finger, one half step. So here I am on E with my middle finger, and you've got that nice major E sound. If I lower that note, now I have a sad, sad minor chord. So I can do that, same thing, with any chord. Here's a G. One, two, three, four, five, four, three, two, one. One, three, and five for the major chord. For the minor chord, lower that middle finger. And we have a sad minor chord. So now, and I know we're moving pretty quick here, you should be able to play every major and minor chord that you can think of just by doing the five note scale, playing one, three, and five, and then uh, if you want it to be minor, lowering that that middle note. Okay, so what you can do, and this is a little tricky, but you want to st go up, start from C, play the play the chord, play the five note scale. This piano's a little out of tune, sorry. half step. Now I would be on, yes, C sharp. And then play the five note scale again. Three of your fingers will already be on the notes in the scale. And then, bum, bum, five note scale. And then up again. the way up the piano several times, um, not only is your dexterity going to improve, but you uh, are going to start to get a feel for, oh, E major's always got that F, sh or the, uh, the G sharp in it. Um, you're going to get a feel for all the major chords and how they feel in your muscle, thing, in your finger muscles. Okay? So that's the first thing. If you're feeling incredibly ambitious and you have a little bit of time on your hand, you can do that with two hands. so 
forth, okay? That takes a little longer than, you know, your first hour playing piano. But that is a great place to start. Just do it with one hand at first. Go all the way up until you are awesome at playing all of the chords and all of the five note scales. And then tune in for the fourth, right? Fourth video and we're actually going to learn how to play a song and then you're going to be a piano player and I will leave you alone. Okay, good stuff. Thank you.